up here. We're going to be doing a reaction to TF2 analysis, red versus blue, part one. It's been a while since I wrote the reaction to one of these. Uh, so uh, yeah, I have like a, I remember when I when I was still living in Montana, I got like a Nintendo Switch. And I got the what they call the uh, Pokemon Shield. That was actually fun. Then I realized something. They actually have a new type of pony talk. But when I first saw it, I was like. So yeah, <laughs> I was pretty excited to get it, but yeah, it was a fun game. The last boss was a really tough, but I managed to beat it. So anyway, all right, okay, now let's get to this. Three, two, one. I wonder what the gang has been up to all these years. Or months, whatever. I've only met them once at the Brony Convention. I don't really have any desire to go back to the Brony Conventions because it's just so boring. There's Goldie, there's Silver Quill, there's Ink Rose. Hey, do you ever wonder why we're here? Because we walked here? No, no, I mean here, on Earth. Because the Earth can sustain life? Oh, no. Silver. I mean, why are we alive? Why oh god, that question. <laughs> because we're born? I hate you. I hate you so very, very much. You know what? Forget it. I will. Thank you. <laughs> hey. I remember when I was heavy, I did that too. I just annihilated everybody. Well, he's supervising. Sometimes Firebrand does the same too. So, what's the problem? Well, it's just that I don't think I've seen him join the red team in battle much since I got here. Well, there was that one time he... No, he went off with Finn during that fiasco. Hmm. Oh, ah! There were those times where he... Poor Lightning Bliss. <laughs> no, wait. Those were just throwaway guys. Also, oh, she's a heavy. Why would she charge her? I tried playing that game again, but my computer is having some issues I where I can't play any game at all, and it's annoying the hell out of me. Oh please, we're Brony reviewers in a TF2 parody. Actually having plot? Get out of here. Speaking of parodies and blatant ripoffs, does this conversation remind you of anything? <laughs> <laughs> They're just talking, it seems. All right, all right. They're copying the red versus blue, the uh, Halo game. It might be annoying. Yeah, the matches are only ten minutes each, so camping out here for hours would just be silly. Poor Finn. Note to self: make a bulletproof helmet. You're making this too easy. I'm actually getting worse. Go f yourself. Ugh. You were aiming at golden, weren't you? Shut up, I'm taunting. <laughs> <laughs> All right, an actual duel. Oh, they'll keep doing that until the match is done. I wonder what keeping. I actually suck as a sniper. Meanwhile. I've had just about enough of our team members constantly doing their own thing during matches. I mean, I've spent months trying to coordinate then help them. between classes. But when push comes to shove, everyone either focuses on getting the high score, classing against a rival for ego points, or they start fleeing in a panic when the slightest thing goes wrong. We're in a first person shooter. Everything's supposed to go wrong. Look, if you want others to listen to you in the middle of battle, then you're gonna have to put a much more commanding presence out in the field. Other than twerking. She's a medic, not a commander. I'm supposed to follow your 
Example. Also, it's a TF2. No one listens to anyone. Time you actually healed one of your teammates in the middle of a fight, medic of the month. Oh no, she didn't. Ugh, I am so eh. sick and tired of that running gag. I'm not healing because I'm focusing more on coordinating a battle plan. And you know what? My teammates are actually following my orders. Need I remind you that I helped start this whole shebang in the first place? <gasps> it's almost like I'm your boss or something. <laughs> Oh, you're going to try to pull that card, huh? Ah, uh, no, do poor Dr. Wolf. <laughs> boss status, it can kiss my... Enough! Both of you, please calm down. <laughs> really? <sighs> Miss Keyframe. I am aware that the blue team is having more trouble sticking to a plan and that you've been working hard on trying to lead them into battle. But speaking from more personal experiences, I do believe that when surrounded by explosions and being hounded on all sides, most ponies tend to follow an inspiring example before any kind of cunning strategy. But not all of our ponies. You have that capability within you, Miss Keyframe, and you have shown sparks of that courage under fire. But perhaps what you need right now is. Huh? Well, that's odd. I wasn't expecting any calls today. Hmm. I'll be right back, you two. And don't think that this conversation is over quite yet. I'm sure you'll get it right one of these days. Not helping, Firebrand. I know both of you are already taken, but I still should. I think her name was Sweetie. Excuse you? Oh, please. You should all be used to the shipping shenanigans by now. <laughs> I'm so proud. <laughs> Silver. <laughs> you both don't have to go through the same goddamn door. You can just wait your turn. Oh, ended far too soon. Hey, sweetie, how are you doing today? Oh, hey, Anny. Just as happy and chipper as usual. Willie, really? nothing bad happening. Anything annoying you in any way? No. Nope. Oh yeah, he's a changeling, so he feeds off negative energy. Never mind. For some weird reason. Ooh, that sounds delicious. <laughs> hmm? Did you say something? Oh, uh, nothing, nothing. Uh, I am just going to get a snack. Is it just me, or did that sound like a double entendre? Isn't it obvious? He's clearly possessed by a demon. You have to free him by, um, hitting him. With me. In the neck area. Multiple times, if necessary. <laughs> Don't you have any non-decapitating urges, even when you're an adorable mink? You wanna get high? No. I could make your eyes glow again. And I could transform and have Finn snuggle your fluff butt. <laughs> uh, you win this round. Meanwhile again! Hello? Yes? Not as funny as they used to be. Oh really? I'm... Rather surprised that you'd be calling us out here. Well, I mean, we've never tried that before, but I will certainly relay your message to both teams. Hmm? What was that? Oh, I see. Well, I think we may still be able to accommodate your request. Hmm. Thank you kindly. Goodbye. I wonder what's up. Even more meanwhile, interlude abuse! You don't get it, Mary. All of this fighting is really hard work. Oh, please. Yeah. All you guys do is run is changeling for me. each other's general direction in the hope that one team causes more collateral damage than the other. You call that hard work? <laughs> Mary, all you do is sit in front of a microphone shouting orders at us. You wouldn't know what hard work was if it fired a bazooka right into your smug little face. You could just magically make everything easy because you're Mary Sue. You know, I'm starting to get really sick and tired of your omnipresence sticking up the place. I beg your pardon! I'm the best thing that 
whatever happened to this series, you know that I am the best announcer ever because I'm ABC. You think it's easy being the best at everything all the time? God, you're acting like you think alicorns just ruin everything. What? No, I don't think alicorns ruin everything. <gasps> I did not just hear you say alicorns ruin everything. Ah, uh, she did not say that. Now look what you did, you upset Blissy. Are you quite proud of yourself? Oh, so you're okay with having that alicorn running around, but not me? You're so speciesist. No respect, no respect at all. We will discuss this later. <laughs> Aw, looks like someone needs a hug. <gasps> Yeah, thanks, Benny Finn. I know it's not good to bottle things. I thought she was gonna but beat him up or something. I shall do so. Uh, good for you. Concurrently, which in case you didn't know, was another word for meanwhile. Synonyms. You know, Ty, do you ever get the feeling that? Did you see that? I was in peril by that ferocious charging buck. But joining these teams was like, uh, oh, I don't know, a mistake. Oh, absolutely not. You see, this flamethrower and I, we've been getting along so well. I had a lot of fun as Lyra. <laughs> all sorts of ideas on how to help Finn with his baking or helping Jasper remake all of his broken pottery. Oh, and I've recently taken up ice sculpting. Did you miss the part where we were supposed to be fighting each other out here? I, I don't know. Do you want to? Not sure, actually. Ever since this all started years ago, I always wanted to be the spy. Now that I finally made it, I admit, I really I suck at spy. Next. Well, you could always join Finn and I in the kitchen. We're putting together a new cookie design tonight. Is that really all you're doing today? Um, hmm. Oh, right! Elior wanted me to practice some flamethrower techniques with her this afternoon. Let's see, I, I think she called it... Uh, spy checking? <laughs> That's the one fun thing about pirates, Actually, just burn everything around you. That's spy checking. <laughs> but then if you have your teammates come by, you just torch them, and you can't kill them, your teammates unless they're a spy. <laughs> Oh boy, distressed pupper ain't good. What's wrong, Doc? Something potentially good and potentially bad. I'll need every pony here for this announcement. Every pony, huh? So You mean every creature? What, next month. Ellie. Honestly, Doc, we can barely get team members to come into group calls. You expect all of us to come to meetings? It's not like something's gonna magically appear in the next ten seconds. Doc! <laughs> Hey, team stick. I got this giant order for half a dozen pizzas back in the shop, and I didn't realize they wanted gluten free dough. They don't even have an allergy, they're just that's pretentiously trendy. Waka waka. What could okay. be a pizza party later? Nom noms. Thank you kindly. Well, at least I got everybody together. <laughs> I shall have to remember Jasper's pie skills more often in the future. <laughs> Get it? Because it's his name. <laughs> Ain't no thing, Doc. Just uh, have every pony give me 15 bits after the show, and we'll be good to go. How much for me? 30 bits. Hey. Oh, that just means I'm special. Wait, what? I didn't mean it. That's not what I was thinking. Oh, that was the opposite of how I wanted it to go. <clears throat> I called you out here because we have been summoned for a job. Wait, a job? As in, off-site? As in, I don't have to wear the sweat-stained suit in the blazing hot sun anymore? Woohoo! Oh, I was wondering who all those cases of deodorant belong to. Well, please, I'm sure you and Tyandaga have it worse than me. I mean, come on, your main weapon is literal heat. 
Yeah, but at least we shower. You know, six to one rule. Oh, oh, what? oh, okay, I see how it is. Just because I have a Y chromosome, that automatically means I don't shower every day. Well, that couldn't be further from the truth, Missy! Clean. Ahem. Actually, that's part of the reason why I called every pony here. For our first mercenary mission, it is imperative that we leave a good impression on the client. He's been aware of our training regiment out here in Coal Town and has been noting how well certain members have been coordinating with each other. All right. Yay. However, only the red team was requested for this mission. So that means the blue team will stay here to guard the fort, so to speak. <gasps> oh boy. Uh, <clears throat> uh, Blissey, please forgive me for what I'm about to say. <laughs> so, is it too late to request a costume change? Sorry, sudden impending doom in my head. Ah, noted and subsequently ignored. I don't know, do you really think it's wise leaving the blue team unsupervised? Eh, not really, no. What's the worst they could do? <laughs> okay, just checking. So, who wants to start a riot? <laughs> Down with the establishment! I guess that's the worst thing that could happen. <laughs> Gosh darn team members. Can't even curse about how mad at them. I'm just. I almost fried out my magic and my physical form just so they could stay healed during SB Junior's attack. I could just... And her super form. <laughs> Calm down, Key. You're better than them. You're better than this. <sighs> I'm bored that I'm flying! <laughs> Uh, uh, hello? Yes? Oh, really? Um, yeah, we could certainly do that once Doc gets back. I'll be sure to... to... Actually, I think I have the perfect team available for you. Right now. You're not really a team. It's a mishmash of idiots. To be continued, ominous. Well, that was my somewhat reaction to TF2 analysis red versus blue. Sorry to talk much, I just didn't know what to say in this. It was just so boring. Compared to the older ones which were actually entertaining. Who knows, maybe this will get better over time. Still got several more I gotta do, react to. But, anyway, hope you guys liked the reaction, and have a nice day.